Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my YouTube channel. So I don't really paint shoes. I mean I paint shoes, but I don't normally paint on top of physical shoes. So I'll just be describing my process while you watch the video and I'll try and tell you what I learned works best and point out my mistakes as we go through the different sections of the video. So right off the bat, one thing I would have done differently with the tape was cut it into smaller pieces and also have a perfect tape job so that it's seamless and I can paint freely without worrying about paint smearing into a panel that I don't mean to paint. Prep job is probably the most important part of the process and this product here called acetone is used to clean the shoes so that the paint itself will adhere better to the clean surface. I recommend buying the biggest jug available at Walmart or Amazon just because you will need to do this for every shoe you paint. I really like this color on midsoles, it gives it a bit of an aged look but more on the beige tan side. I will say this is not recommended to be used on midsoles, the best technique for this is to stain it but I'll be using these shoes to go cruising on my bike and as daily beaters so I'm not worried about longevity. Uh, regardless I mixed it with Angelus Too Hard That's what she said. <laughs> out of 50-50 ratio to give it more strength. And like I say, after I offer any advice, but I don't know, so it's up to you. With this type of paint, it's always best to apply multiple thin coats until you get the coverage wanted, making sure to wait until the first coat dries before applying another coat on top. I recommend taping off the bottom half of the midsole with vinyl tape as masking tape won't adhere as well. Unless you have surgeon like dexterity like your boy and can make the cuts with a brush. I actually enjoy doing this part by hand. I'm not a fan of the lime green lining so I decided to paint it black and to do this I used black paint and mixed it with two soft That's what she said! <laughs> what? by Angelus, which is used for fabrics. I recommend doing one coat and letting it dry or use a heat gun if you have one and apply another thin coat after it dries. Well, that's it. Really like how these came out for my first time painting shoes. Again, I'm not a shoe customizer and this channel is mostly about my sneaker illustrations, but I had fun doing this and wanted to share. Hope you like it.